Right, good evening and welcome to my weekly 10 show. Um, tonight I'm going to be talking about um, stress and how we create stress ourselves by focusing on outcomes and how we can actually get rid of stress, reduce it and uh, create a mindset which is actually successful all of the time without having that constant stress of having to push ourselves and feeling that we haven't got time to achieve things and we're doing too much and all the things that actually create us create stress in our lives um and hold us back really so yeah so so before i go into that i just want to say i'm still available for one-to-one -one coaching um i'm actually doing a live event tomorrow where i'm speaking to i'm um, doing a um, live speaking event at the oval cricket ground hang on i'm just turning my phone off because i should have done that earlier um to about 200 people so that's gonna be fun and i've also just uh, now um, found out that i'm doing a webinar in december to 100,000 people as well which is an hour long it's going to be a live webinar um and i'll keep you posted on that you can sign up and watch it live if you want to and um i'll keep i'll give you details of that nearer the time um so yeah it's, it's going to be a busy month so anyway yeah so the difference between uh having a mastery mindset and a performance based mindset what does that mean i mean on surface it means nothing does it so basically when we when we focus on performing to an out uh, to a level a certain level to achieve certain outcomes in life what we inadvertently do is create stress for ourselves and what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you an idea of how this works and how you can create a mindset which is free of stress all of the time you know because stress is one of the worst things that holds us back it creates um, pressure it hold, uh, makes us feel that we're not good enough and it keeps us in a very low energy where we don't get done what we really want to do in life and then we blame other things and we find reasons um, for, uh, for, fault, uh, for the reason for that. But really, it's our mental approach and how we go about um, focusing on things, which creates that stress. So if you can find a way to remove that stress from your life, um, you'll, create, you'll be much more productive generally across the board. So, OK, so if you've got a performance based mindset, you're generally motivated by ego. So you're always focused on uh, performing um, better than other people. You'll tend to have a, a win-lose sort of mentality. So you've got to win and that other guy's got to lose for you to be validated, to feel good about the situation. Um, your your self-worth is pretty much tied up in that belief that um, how you perform um, shows up how you are, who you are as a person. So if you don't perform to the level that you're expected to, it's going to uh, reflect badly on you. So it's all very much about the performance. It's about winning and losing. It's about being better than other people, comparing yourself to other people and how they perform as well, and trying to reach that level of performance that somebody else might have, for instance. So you judge outcomes as either good or bad. You'll see situations as black or white, right or wrong. So there's no middle ground. You either win or you, do, you lose. It's one or the other. So you're motivated primarily by reward. And that could be in terms of monetary reward. We all like money. But at the end of the day, it's not, that it's, it's, it's not money that should motivate you in life, really. And it's all the same. It, you could be, it doesn't necessarily have to be money. It could be something like praise. You know, if you're a, a reward, you might be motivated to get praise at work by your boss or someone to turn around and say, oh, look, he's done well. And if that's what motivates you, then that's a performance mindset where you're focusing on performing to a certain level in order to get recognised by certain people. Or whether it be in monetary terms, praise or whatever. So it's still a mindset which creates stress because if you don't reach the level that you're holding up for yourself, then suddenly you become stressed. You criticise yourself, you feel inferior, you feel like you've not performed at your uh, maximum or the level that you should be performing at. Um, the other side of it, the flip side of that is mastery. Now here with mastery, you're, you're not, you're not focused on any outcomes whatsoever. So there's no, um, uh, outcome in the distance that you're working towards because, um, you know 
But when you're focused, when you live uh, live a master uh, life with a mastery mindset, you're always um, developing. You're continually developing. There's no end product. There's no end outcome. So you're always developing all of the time in everything that you do continually. You're performing to become the best version of yourself. So you're not comparing yourself to anybody. You're not saying to yourself, I want to be like him. I want to earn more money than him. You're not. You're, you're only focused on being the best version of yourself. And, and each day, bit by bit, improving, learning, growing, and increasing your own worth within you internally. Because you're internally focused when you're focused on a master. You're not outwardly focused. You're not focusing on a win-lose perspective. You're not thinking about what other people are doing or comparing yourself to what other people are doing. You're thinking about how you're doing, how you're performing and how you're growing and what you're learning. And you're motivated generally by feelings of happiness, pleasure, satisfaction, fulfillment, things that make you feel good. So it's not like, ah, oh, I've beaten that guy, I'll feel good. You feel good because you've learned something. You've done something productive. You've moved in the right direction in, in, in terms of your in, own internal growth. So you're not actually concerned in any way with any outcomes. There's no outcome that's in your mind whatsoever because you know that whatever happens in life, you're going to grow. So even if the outcome that you didn't expect to happen happens, you're still learning. You're still growing. You're still become, You're still winning, even though there isn't a win-lose perspective because it's a win-win perspective. So you're not winning over somebody else. You're winning in every situation because whatever happens in life, you're going to grow from it. You're going to learn from it. You're going to improve. And that's the difference between a mastery mindset and a performance mindset where you focus only on um, achieving a particular goal or achieving a, 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 some sort of outcome and performing at a certain level. So with a mastery mindset, you're continually growing. You're continually moving in the right direction. You're continually internally growing and focusing inwards so that you know that you're always becoming a better version of yourself day by day. So that's the, essentially how you grow as an individual, by learning what makes you tick as a person and what makes you grow and how you can improve bit by bit. And... It's a fact that um, mastery, people who, who, who resonate with a mastery mindset tend to have a much higher energy, generally, than people with a performance mindset. Performance mindset might be conflict-driven, for instance. So, so they'll be they'll be low energy, but they'll be comparing each other with a win-lose um, um, frame of reference. That's a very low energy because it's, it's built out of conflict. Um, but when you're at a higher energy, there is no win-lose perspective. It's a win-win perspective. Everybody wins. You're winning. They're winning. Everybody wins. So your energy is a much higher level all, all of the time. And that means you're going to be much more successful in the long run in whatever you do in life. So you, you're always going to be more productive. You're always going to be more happier, more um constructive in everything that you do you're going to be much more fulfilled much more satisfied with your life and everything that you do um will feel like you're moving in uh, you're being successful it doesn't matter what what outcome you expect because if you don't have, have an outcome in your mind then you won't expect no outcomes and the thing is when you're when you when you're operating at this level when, uh, with a mastery mindset it's important to trust the process of of life basically because life doesn't happen when you want it to happen it doesn't happen how you think it should happen so you've got to have faith in life you've got to have faith in yourself more than anything because faith is the one thing that keeps people going when things aren't going the way they think they should so if, if you're having a bad day for instance um have faith in yourself sometimes it can be difficult but it, it's important that you do and it's also important to always think to yourself what am i learning in this situation because even if you're going through something very difficult in life there's a point to it there's a learning point or growth to it that you can actually take away and then use later on in life as you move forward so it might be difficult at the moment whatever you're going through but when you take a step back and reflect upon it in a more objective, um, conscious way, without the judgment, without all of the, um, the limiting beliefs and assumptions and things like that surrounding it, you can then see it 
with clarity and then, then you can take away something that's actually worthwhile from any situation so even the worst situations you're learning from you're growing from and you're moving forward with because you're not focused on outcomes and outcomes create stress and if you want stress in your life focus on outcomes but if you want to live a life which is happy fulfilled and as, as little stress as possible then i would say to you consider learning how to create a mastery mindset which works for you in any situation and that way you're always going to be productive you're always going to be moving in the right direction and you're always going to be creating something special in your life and that's essentially what i help people do with my coaching i help people with a philosophy and a way of being i educate them with, uh, around that i help them raise their confidence increase their self um, esteem um, and help them work through whatever's going through in their lives to remove the blocks, the barriers and the mental um, things like fear, limiting beliefs, all those sort of things from you, from your mindset so that you can see much clearer and you can start creating the things that you really want out of life. And that's just what, that's the way you, we, we, um, is the most um, successful way of doing it is through creating a mastery mindset instead of a performance mindset. And if you're interested in finding out more about how I can help you create that, then um, I would um, suggest you get in touch with me and my details are going to be in the box at the bottom of this uh, video in the comment section and you can also sign up for my newsletter as well because there's going to be um, in the next month I think it is we're going to, I'm going to be giving away um, excerpt segments of my new upcoming book uh, which is going to be out hopefully in February and um, but if you want to get segments of, or excerpts or whatever you want to call it from that um then sign up in my newsletter and you'll get them earlier over christmas before christmas uh so you'll have a little taste of my book okay so yeah i hope, hope that's helpful if anyone wants to ask me any questions about that then get in touch and i will see you all next time bye